I, I met someone from San Ildefonso Pueblo who said that the laboratory will only be here for a moment in time, and when the laboratory is gone, the land will come back to the Pueblos. I am an archaeologist at the laboratory. I'm also the team leader for the resources management team, which includes cultural and biological resources, as well as um, National Environmental Policy Act compliance. When I told my father that I was going to be an archaeologist, his number one concern was, do they pay people to play in the dirt? And when I got my job at Los Alamos National Laboratory, he was just blown away. And as an archaeologist, to work at a national laboratory and have the opportunity to look at sites and understand sites and do research and also be sure that we're protecting these resources is really just an amazing gift. And uh, I, I have often said I have the best job in the world. There are at least 2,000 archaeological sites on laboratory property, and so everywhere that you go, you are probably within 100 feet of an archaeological site. I understand my role here, in part, is to be a good steward of the environment so that if the laboratory is here or if someone else is here, the land is still intact and is sustainable in the future. In order to understand the relationship between the mission of the laboratory and the archaeology of the laboratory, you have to understand that federal laws and, and various kinds of environmental compliance are incredibly important to enabling the mission. So you can't have the mission unless you protect the resources and you can't uh, protect the resources in the right way unless you understand the mission of the laboratory. So the passion I have for um, protecting the resources and understanding the interaction between the mission and the resources is vital to keeping the laboratory running and to keep it running in a way that is respectful to the environment. Um, a lot of times I meet people and they say, oh, you work at Los Alamos National Laboratory and they have varying ideas of what that means. And what I always explain to them is that there are a great number of people at the laboratory who care a great deal about the environment and make sure that there are very few impacts to the environment. So I see my legacy as creating a sustainable future and to be a good steward of the land that we are on in this moment of time. Mm -hmm.